Welcome back for another video guys. Today we will be searching through $100 worth of nickels. We'll be searching for silver, key dates, error coins, all that good stuff. Don't forget at 500 subscribers we will be giving away some silver so press subscribe. <laughs> All right, guys, so we have $100 in nickels, and these nickels here, check out these. Now this, that looks like an old, that definitely looks like an old nickel roller. These kind of look older too. I mean, I guess they're not, but they're a lot different than the other ones. So we're not gonna save them for last. We're gonna open them right now. Let's get into it. Dun -dun -dun. All right, just to give you guys a little update, just found a 1941 Philadelphia Mint. Uh, it's not the rarest coin, but heck, we're only, what, three rolls in. All right, guys, so I just got these in one roll, all the same roll. So we got 1940, 1947, and 1957, all Philadelphia Mint. All in one roll, so that was pretty nice. 1940, 47, and 57. 57 is the lowest mintage out of those three. Now, on to my finds. These are just some interesting coins. Let me focus here. That I found. Obviously, they're destroyed. If anyone has any information on this, this would be great to, to figure out because the, the nickel, you know, the nickel layer came off and it just went straight to the copper layer. For this one, it looks like it had a gold coating over it I mean you can kind of tell the tint interesting if you know anything about that let me know also picked up Canadians 1982 83 84 and 87 and on to the 50s so we got 59 all the way across we got a 58 and a 58 D a 57 and a 57 D and then down here we got a 56 55 and 53 we come over here these two are the Philadelphia men's and they are in 1952 so the top two are 1940s and every single one of these are Philadelphia men except for this last coin I'm gonna show you here the 1940s 1941 42 46 246s 47 and then this is the only Denver Mint out of the 40s and that would be a 1948 so for this coin I really wanted to pull my camera out and show you guys when I was getting it it's the only Buffalo nickel I found out of every single every single roll hundred dollar rolls my hands are dirty so kind of excuse me for that all these coins and then when I flipped it over I seen that it was dateless so and it's I mean it's worn as it can get it's in pretty bad shape so but it's still cool getting a buffalo. Thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media at Real Justin Couch. And tell me in the comments below what kind of video you want me to do next. Remember, at 500 subscribers, we will be giving away some silver. And this is where I disappear.